Her name is Evie Rock the Boat. She's feeling groovy Rock the Boat. Mess with her Rock the Boat. She'll kick your booty Rock the Boat. These tots are hot. She's waiting to see if Sarah drops something. These are hot toddies. <laughs> These are hot toddies. Sarah made some sandwiches that we're having, or some burgers that we're having on tortillas. And by made, I heat them. And we have some weird hoodoo voodoo cauliflower delicious looking tater tots. And we're going to the movies tonight, right? Do we decide which one? No. I think the World War is a good one because it's Veterans Day this weekend. Oh, that's true. The, and that's what our um, Chicago airport is named after. Veterans Day? Wait, wait, wait. I thought there's a movie called Midway. Is that what we're going? That's the, that's the name that's, of the movie? Yeah, yeah that's, that's, what, that's what Midway Airport's named after. Yeah, that's what I said. Let's do it! Hey, yo, Bex. Thanks for the hookup. We got these yummy candies because they're called Yum Earth. Mm -hmm. Get it? Yum. Delicious. It's all vegan. Vegan, pomegranate, vitamin C, organic, called Orgo. Uh, I'm going to eat all these on the way to the Disney Springs because we're hitting up that Springs tonight. Friday night Springs night. Mm -hmm. Christmas sugar boo. Or at least winter sugar boo. Also, winter sugar boo. We're so glad you're here. Uh, we're so glad you're here. We're daily vlogs. So if you enjoy this video, make sure you come back tomorrow on the next day, next day, next day. Sugar boo every day. Oh. Roll post. Oh gosh. Peace on the earth. Ornaments. <gasps> nice velveteen mask. Okay, this is like what we're gonna wear. Cute little dish and wine bottle holder. And the pig. How are you today? Oh, in a little fairy house. Ah. A Christmas unicorn. <laughs> Peter did break that, by the way. He's got I did, it in his right hand. Here. He's not going to be able to. Cups. Cute play. Well, we love Christmas. this. Um, where did we buy ours? We have Route 66 one. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Uh huh. In the city of North Pole. That's definitely a buddy of the elf right there. <laughs> I have that on all yesterday. We're watching elf. Oh, I want to watch it. We can watch it tonight. Okay. Nothing more refreshing than a fresh weekend start at Disney Springs at our favorite place, Sugar Boo. Yes, it was awesome in there. It made, like, I feel like I'm in the Christmas spirit at home because we have our decorations up and then like going out and it's still Christmassy. So it's good. really getting the vibes going. Yeah. We're getting popcorn at the movie tonight. It's and I'm so, so it's all I can think about. It's raining. It is, it's but so we're gonna, gonna be We're gonna try to get our make our way all the way over to the Christmas tree trail. Cause Sarah said the Christmas trees are up. So yeah. we gotta go see. We have about a little less than an hour before we gotta be at the movie. Wait, 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 wait. Before we go into Christmas anthropology and Sarah loses herself, did we announce what we purchased the other day? We purchased so far one-way tickets to Chicago yes. because there were no good out. flights on the return flight yet. So we're waiting to see. But we have our flights booked to Chicago. November 27th. Oh. That's super Look cute, it. but what's this? Sarah literally was like, I need a long sweater as a jacket for I Chicago, need... but it's like 20 degrees. I don't think we realize how cold it is there. I don't have a winter coat anymore. Um, I think it's cold today and it's like 68 degrees out right now. It feels good out here. Like I like it feels, it feels crushing, too. but it does. But I like feel it like it's nice to be cold and cozy. You know? Yeah, but it's let's go check the clearance. I had to show this cute lamb made of yarn balls. This is, this is gonna be in Lauren's work like office shop. This should be in her workshop right now. It's so great. Secretly love that place. It's so weird that it's gonna be here, but I secretly love it. It's my wife, the surfer gal. <laughs> I don't like the beach. Salt water. <laughs> I don't like the ocean. A shark. <laughs> We're not gonna go in, but we'll see you later. I think. Oh, I love those pants. I think you should have said we'll see you in the flippity flip. Oh. All right, we're breaking something. We're breaking out of our norm, which we all know how much we hate doing this. But we're not going this way in the 23 in Maine. We're going this way in the Disney Tales to see if they've got Eve's. What? 
28 in Maine. 28 in Maine. What did I say? 23? 28 in Maine. We're going into Christmas Disney Tales to look for Eve's vest that we missed out on getting last year. It doesn't look promising. Oh, I see a shirt. I don't know about a vest, but a shirt maybe. Oh. We need the vest though. Yeah. That's cute, but she doesn't like her arms. <gasps> this is cute. And it's a clasp. I dig that. There's this year's model. I like it more than last year's. I do too. I like this material. Do you see there's a patch of Pluto? And it's matching the ears I'm going to get later too. And it's got Mickey ears and I think it's got reindeer ears. Oh, if they have the size. And I think it's even important. I like the clasp here and the clasp here in front of the chest. And then it attaches back here. That's what we need for Eve. <laughs> <laughs> this is AJR. This is our favorite, one of our favorite bands. <laughs> we just found them. Here's the question. Is it frozen or is it frozen too? I see two carrots, so I think it's frozen too. But you never know. He's also got some wind going on with leaves. That is a frozen two ornament. It's frozen two. Not frozen one, frozen two. Oh. For my birthday, I really oh, like birthday. them. Yeah, that's a good, that's like, we are so selective with our merchandise purchases. Like, we when you really like Christmas. something, we need it for th before Thanksgiving. I know, but it's like, it's, holiday, it's the Christmas time for us now, yeah. so we need it for the Christmas time now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you need to buy it right now? Okay, you can buy it right now. No way. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So the trees are all the same this year, but these like little paintings and stuff on the wood um, fences are incredible. Do I fit in? Look at my new I can't believe it. You're so happy. And it's light. It's like a little thinner on top, so it's a little less warm but a better grippy grip, it's so good. Well, if this isn't the best way to start off your weekend with a Sugar Boo Christmas style Christmas springs and then a new Christmas hat. The thing is, guys, like Sarah pointed out, we are very intentional with the merchandise we buy ourselves. The ears that you've seen me wear, like the Christmas Santa hat, we got on our college program. I think. Were those the same ones? Yes. Or did we like ever get We've a We never replaced them. Okay. We just cut them to make them because they <laughs> shrunk and I have a big old head. And I'm, we're gonna keep those because they're a different style. They're like the more formal ones. Yeah. These are the athleisure eth wear ones. Um, my lumberjack ones. No, I love So we're it. keeping them. But like those other ones are probably thirty dollars, and we've had them for, gosh, eight years. Eight years now, and we're still gonna have them. So. Yeah, they're worth it, worth and like it. it's something that you're gonna wear. I don't even know how much. Chair. They were 30 bucks, but we got a DVC or annual pass discount or something. Yeah. I don't know. Sarah said get them and I got them. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Movie time? Yes. Popcorn time? <laughs> oh, Ample Hills coming to Disney Springs. Sarah. Gosh. Oh, here it is. Guys, we love Beatrix. We're gonna go there once a week. We're doing there once a week. It's our new thing. Yes. And we'll show you guys it there. And then the, we'll show you there's only one other, and it's in Chicago. Oh, I saw the, the poster on the inside. Oh, what I've been dreaming about all day. Besides my ears. I really have been, but the ears were a total surprise. We're gonna get our free refill on the way out, maybe. Oh my god. Bring it home. Put it in our almost empty bag of popcorn. AMC stubs for the win until we become. Disney Plus members this week, next week. Oh my gosh, I forgot about that. And then, um, I have rewards too, so the next time we can get another popcorn. Another popcorn. Sweet Sarah can't do her Ryan family trick and butter it up and, and well, salt it up. Well, that butter is vegan. I don't, oh. I don't think that, I don't, I don't think, think that's... that one is. This is what I saw from outside. This beauty, beauty, beauty of a sign. Look at the stars. Look at this little, this little dweeby-looking beautiful guy. Did you hear that um, Kristen Bell and a 
Idina Menzel are getting a double star on the Hollywood. Oh, <gasps> that's of so cool. Yeah. As their names or as Anna and Elsa? As them, but together. Because of Anna and Elsa? Yeah. That's so awesome. Look at how stoic and heroic Sven looks. Ready to go? Yeah. All right, so we're not very far going in. We're going all, all the way to number two. Oh first, first theater on the right. So we are Al, so we're on the second floor, I think, right? I don't know my alphabet too well. You want to go to college? To want to learn a new skill? Start a new career? Want a promotion? Yeah. A raise? A fancy car? Want to get in? Wow. Wow. Did you like it? I liked it. I, it was long and I expected it to be long because like war, old time war movies like that are usually really long. Mm -hmm. But I think they did a good job of like showing the drama and the history along with just like the battle scenes too. Right. I thought um, stylistically it was beautiful. I thought it would never, it's not going to like win any awards or be critically acclaimed. But I never knew that story and I'm, you know, like, and we're like our... Yeah, everybody was real. It was, everybody was historically... Right, so like, of course it is like dramatized because it's a movie and whatnot, so but like I'm sure those it's, people existed. Right, and um, so it was, I just never really knew that story, so like I thought it was just really cool to like learn it all. Yeah. Oh goodness. It's chilly, it's moist out. It's midnight. It's midnight, I'm supposed to run, <laughs> but we'll see. Maybe yeah. I'll get a urge of, a gurge, a surge of energy on the way home. <laughs> oh. I think they're selling tickets already, I believe. I think so too. Look at this, set your imagination in motion and let yourself be amazed at Cirque du Soleil. Oh no, I didn't get to read the rest of it. <laughs> I'm Something a about reader. Disney animation. Celebrating Disney animation. I can't wait, I hope it's still like super quirky. Oh, I'm sure it is. But like the touch of Disney. Like, Should we go to like, are we going to a theme park tomorrow? We gotta see where the day goes. <laughs> Sarah and I are both working this weekend. Yeah. Bummer. Bummer city. Oh gosh, look at this good girly. Story. Ew. Well, well, well. If it isn't the message for November 8th. The message for the 8th is by Ernest Hemingway. And it says, now is no time to think of what you do have. Think of what you can do with what there is. That looks really bright and sunny. This looks sunlit. Huh. Yes, in fact, it is the very next morning. Sarah and I both fell asleep on the couch and woke up. I woke up at like 6.30. Um, looked at all of us. Eve was cut cute and resting right by us. So I was like, I'm not going to disturb us right now fall back asleep and now that it's like 7.30 I have to get up and start my day and I think Sarah might be getting up but I'm gonna start work which is weird because like I slept really well because we did get home late and we started we didn't go straight to bed but I feel like I didn't sleep because I was on the couch and then I woke up and it's the next day and now I have to do work stuff so time to time to go but it's the next day but it's not the next day it's good to be home we know what our goals are we know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. 